Tomorrow, Blue Walker 3 will be launched into orbit from the Kennedy Space Center at Cape Canaveral in Florida. The launch time has been set for 6 a.m. Easter Standard Time and satellite will be traveling at an altitude of 370 miles above Earth's surface with its final destination being the Clark Belt above Antarctica. What is this new generation of satellites and what are they used for? Users of smartphones, laptops, and other mobile devices should be ecstatic to hear that a Texas-based AST Space Mobile is launching a Blue Walker 3, a new generation of satellite that will light up the night sky. Developed by combining U.S. Air Force space knowledge with modern technology, Blue Walker 3's large satellite could become brighter than any other object in the sky except for the moon. The Purpose One of the purposes is to enable users to receive 4G, 5G mobile coverage in remote areas. For those who may not know what 4G and 5G means, it stands for 4th generation wireless and 5th generation wireless technologies respectively. 4th generation wireless has been implemented since 2010 with 5th generation wireless deployed in 2019. Now how do you launch something so big? Launching a satellite into space is not as easy as throwing it up in the air. You can't simply load up an overgrown volleyball in a cannon and hope for the best. They actually build scaffolding around it to protect it from possible impact and start prepping it a couple of days in advance. Blue Walker 3 creators spent years getting approval from air traffic control agencies, ground sensors, local municipalities, fire departments, NASA, FAA, etc. Before this bird ever left the hangar, what makes a satellite bright? The brightness of a satellite is determined by how much direct sunlight it reflects. Some experts estimate that Blue Walker 3 could be visible from over 100 miles away. It will be positioned at 7 degrees south of the equator, where it's nighttime nearly all year round. Who will see it, when and where? The launch pad is set to occur along with Starlink Group 4-2 from Launch Pad LC-39A from the Kennedy Space Center in Florida on Saturday, September 10th. It is a giant satellite, so if you have really clear and dark skies, you will be able to see it up there. One of the cool things about Blue Walker 3 is that this technology could bring a 4G or 5G signal to those who don't have it right now, like rural communities that are far away from cell towers. Where can I find out more information? Looking to learn more about how Blue Walker 3 can help get 4G and 5G coverage to remote areas? If you are interested in knowing more about the AST's mission and space know-how, feel free to visit their website.